the Ghana Anti-Corruption Coalition has described as defective justification by the Electoral Commission to compile a new voters register comprising over 20 civil society groups. The coalition is of the view that the that country does not need any new voters register. The controversy over the need or otherwise for a new voters register rages on even after the Electoral Commission's advisory council's request to the EC to further engage stakeholders. The issue has torn the political front further apart. On one side is the NDC and its opposing allies and the other the ruling NPP and its 13 political allies endorsing the Electoral Commission's position. The Electoral Commission has already secured its 400 million city budgetary allocation for the exercise insisting that the register is bloated and the biometric verification device obsolete. But the coalition disagrees. We and our IT experts have thoroughly examined the Electoral Commission submissions and found them unfortunately quite defective and unconvincing. One issue is whether Ghana needs a completely new biometric voter management system, BVMS, an end-to-end -end infrastructure comprising hardware, software, data centers, databases, and fresh mass enrollment of voters. The coalition contends that the EC has not been able to demonstrate that the biometric data is not good enough for the December 7 polls. We believe that the EC has not demonstrated that there is a defect with the biometric data which was used as recently as two months ago on a nationwide scale to necessitate the spending of $70 million on mass registration. It has already conducted limited registration for the district elections and should be using that benchmark cost for the general elections limited registration. If the EC wishes to acquire new BVRs and BVDs, and so far, it has said little to justify why it needs to do so. It is the position of the coalition that the facial recognition feature the EC intends to introduce to verify voters is a backward technology. They further argued that even though the constitution in Article 45 mandates the EC to compile a voter's register, it does not mean it should be new. The law uses the word compile. This does not suggest that the EC must always create a totally new system. Indeed, the law envisages a situation where the information exists in various forms or even at various places and requires the EC not to recreate the information, but rather to compile the data. A compilation clearly means the EC must collate it from existing sources. Incidentally and fortunately, there exists a national institution set up and empowered by law to collect such information for the purpose of national identification and related uses. The coalition wants the EC to collaborate with the National Identification Authority to use its logistics to collect data which may be required to update the current voters register. Meanwhile, some of the CSOs have been engaging the EC on the way forward.